President Duterte has promised to fork over 40 million pesos to the quake hit town of Itbayat, Batanes. Meanwhile, the NDRRMC is recommending declaring a state of calamity in the whole province of Batanes. Dindo Flora has the story. The National Disaster Risk Reduction Management Council, or NDRRMC, is calling on local government of Batanes to declare a state of calamity in the province following the twin quakes that hit Itbayat on Saturday. President Duterte, together with Senator Bongo, flew to Batanes on Sunday to check the situation on the ground during a situation briefing in Basco. NDRMC Executive Director Ricardo Halad said the Office of Civil Defense, or OCD, has been providing continuous assistance to the residents of Itbayat. At least eight people were dead, 60 others were injured, and one person still missing when two quakes, a magnitude 5.4 and magnitude 5.9, struck Batanes on Saturday morning. There were no tsunami alerts, but as of Monday morning, the FIBOX recorded more than 20 aftershocks. After the aerial inspection with Senator Go, Duterte instructed local officials to ensure that the food and water supplies are enough for affected residents. Duterte also promised to allot 40 million pesos for the reconstruction of the hospital in Itbayat that was damaged by the quake. Meanwhile, the Cagayan Valley Regional Disaster Risk Reduction and Management Council has directed all deployment to Batanes. The Regional Council says, while communication lines are working, the biggest problem in the quakes aftermath are damaged utilities. Lahat naman ng communication lines doon ngayon ay functional. Yung tubig, yun ay isa sa magiging problema natin dahil as of now, yung kuryente nila ay down pa rin. So yun titignan natin na no, makapagdala tayo ng mga tubig doon sa Itbayat. For News 5, Dindo Flora, we are One News.